This Link Sprinter tool is what we use to get the switch name and port information when we're doing switch port configuration. This is an easier and more accurate way than tracing the cables manually in your closet. First step is to plug in the Ethernet cable to the Link Sprinter. For example, this is the port that I want to get the switch information. I'm just going to plug in the Ethernet cable from there to the Link Sprinter tool. The next step would be to power on the Link Sprinter tool. And if the port is properly patched into the switch, it will all light up green. Just like this, and this means that it is now processing the information of the switch. Then next is to double press the button to connect to the Link Sprinter. This is how you will see the switch information. And as you can see, the blue indicator light in here is lighting up, so it means that you can pair your phone to the Link Sprinter tool. Next step is to pair your phone with the Link Sprinter tool, and if you go to your Wi Fi settings, you should see the Link Sprinter tool in there and just select it. Once you're paired to the Link Sprinter, you can now connect the device to a browser via the default IP address that's set for the Link Sprinter, which is 172.16.9.9. After typing in the IP address on a browser, you will be able to access the switch information now. So you'll see the switch name, the HCP, port number, and other information for the switch port. And you can also configure it to send the results to your team's email address, for example, and this is called the Link Live Email Notifications. So that's how you use the Link Sprinter tool. If you have any questions, please let me know in the comment section below.